Good afternoon everybody. Here we are in the field where we have the the little bit of clover that we were seeing if the glyphosate would kill it. Now we're actually heading towards planting today if you can look over in the distance there there's John getting ready to get a start planting the oats so we'll go and have a look at that later but I want to come in here because this had two litres of glyphosate about four weeks ago but just last week because there was some brome in here that we thought wasn't quite wasn't quite dying the way we thought it was given another two litres so the clover was also given another two litres but we'll we'll see if we can find it now we'll just have a look at what's here at the moment and well you can see let's just have a, a quick overview yeah all the wheat that was there and all the other stuff you can safely say that's dying if we take a little look down here chickweed yeah dying quite nicely looking a bit sick um we've got some cleavers there they're taking a bit of time to die but they're definitely looking a bit sick and not very well at all so let's see if we can find this clover it's a it's along here oh there it is there there you go see how green that still is i think you can safely see there's a little bit there looking a little bit sick but look at that that is as healthy as you can as you like really so i think we can safely say that what we were trying to do we've achieved that's looking a little bit sick but i'll we'll see after this has been planted and in a few weeks time well we're going to keep an eye on this we're going to see how it how it comes along but i'm actually quite pleased with that um because towards the possible undersown white clover into spring barley and then possibly being able to control weeds with glyphosate in it in the spring before we plant the second crop into it and the third and the fourth for as long as it may last that little experiment with that clover looks as if it could well be a possibility so we're quite happy with that so we'll pop across now and we'll have a look at the, at the drill when it's going and this aspen we need uh, John's wanting a little bit of a hand to calibrate which I'd forgot all about he'll be cursing me best run 